In our continuing coverage out of York County, Grafton High School and middle school students are getting ready for another change following a fire that devastated their campus. The school division held a public forum to answer questions and concerns from families tonight. Tonight, on your side, Gina Revelo was there. And Gina, what's happening moving forward? Well, Tom and Anita, the Grafton students have been attending York High School and Tab Middle School on an alternating schedule, but come April, they'll move to Tab High School and Yorktown Middle School, and their school day will also be a little longer. The change was made as part of a worst-case scenario plan in case the Grafton complex doesn't reopen by the end of May as planned. York County school officials say the new academic plan for Grafton High School and middle school students may not be the perfect solution, but it's the best option that meets the most needs. By switching to two others, now we have six schools involved, but they all will be able to reach their instructional hours mandated by the state. One of the biggest concerns many Grafton parents have is making sure their students are still getting a quality education. Right now, students are going to class on Tuesdays, Thursdays, and Saturdays. Now, I have noticed my, my, some of my children's grades are slipping or getting zeros because maybe the assignment wasn't clear. Sherry Seacrest has three kids who relocated from the Grafton complex. She says the alternating days make communication between students and teachers challenging at times. Some days it's like easy, but some days it's really stressful because I don't know what to do. School officials reassured parents they're working with teachers to utilize one main platform of communication for a smoother transition. Superintendent Dr. Victor Shander says it's been a learning experience for the entire district. I'm more proud of our teachers than I've ever been and how they're uh, adjusting to this new schedule. I really feel like we're on the right track to success at this point. Another big concern, but this one is more for the students, prom. Students are scheduled to attend class the same day as prom, but school officials say they are meeting this weekend to discuss logistics and to make sure the event can still go on without any issues. Gina Arevalo, 10 on your side.